Going to discuss the difference in the engine control system fault lights and the time limited dispatch lights. The CJ1+, 2+, and 3 are FADIC equipped. With the FADIC system you have two types of indications that represent FADIC issues. Time limited dispatch or TLD and engine control system faults, ECS faults. TLD lights are in the tail cone of the CJ1+, 2+, and 3. The CJ1 Plus TLD lights are located on the right hand upper side of the tail cone as seen here. The CJ2 Plus and 3 are located on the left hand aft side of the tail cone as seen here. The TLD lights do not affect the dispatchability of, in any way. These lights can be illuminated in any fashion and they do not affect the dispatchability of the aircraft. The engine control system faults or ECS faults do affect the aircraft dispatchability. These faults are illuminated in the cockpit on the enunciator panel, middle row, left hand side as seen here. If there is an ECS left or right, the FADEX have to be interrogated and these faults cleared before the aircraft can be dispatched. The ECS lights can be cleared using the FADEC reset button in front of the pilot's right knee on the instrument panel or the EMT kit from Williams International. The aircraft cannot dispatch with these ECS lights illuminated. There are many issues that could cause the ECS and TLD faults, including but not limited to issues with aircraft components, procedural errors, and pilot-induced faults.